Good morning, YouTube. <laughs> As you can see right here, I have a video uploading that I started uploading yesterday afternoon. And uh, it's two hours and 44 minutes long. It's um, me mowing the snow, right? What it took for me to clear the yard. Basically, I burned up a whole tank of gas on the gadget, on the snowblower. And when it started dying, <laughs> I was dead. So I threw it in the garage covered in snow. I'm sure the heated garage will melt all the snow off of it. And I might do a little bit more today, but I really don't have to. I got pretty much, mm -hmm. I got pretty much everything done. But the video, I'll never do that again. <laughs> There's no reason why it's taken this long to upload, except it, YouTube don't like it. It's too long. And speaking of YouTube, if you look, yellow, yellow. <clears throat> If you watch those two videos, there's no reason for them to demonetize those two videos. They're good videos. It's really weird to me how and why YouTube picks and chooses what videos they deem unsuitable for advertisers, right? It's more censorship. It Really, it is. Let the advertisers decide whether or not they want to stick a commercial on one of my crazy videos, right? And I don't care because, I mean, I got 3,000 videos. I got like 30, 40 bucks in, in the kitty, right, on YouTube. It'll never pay the bills. Not unless I got hundreds of thousands of subscribers. I got a thousand. That'll never happen, right? This channel, if this channel was ever going to blow up, it should have done it by now. But, never say never, Johnny. Anything's possible. So, oh, there was something I wanted to say about the gadget and the YouTubing. Oh, here's one for you. How, how does YouTube decide what commercials to put on your videos? Do the advertisers get to pick? Does YouTube pick? I get the trippiest shit on my videos. See, I pay attention to everything. And so when I post a video, I'll go back and watch it. And then I'll watch the commercials they put on it. And it trips me out. Some of the stuff they put on there, it's really... I got foreign language commercials on my videos. Now, why is that? It must be because of people that watch my videos, right? That must what that must that must be what triggers the algorithm, right? If somebody watches one of my videos and they're from India, right? And they don't speak English, maybe the gadget'll put a commercial for somebody from India. I don't know. I it just it trips me out why some of the stuff is on my videos. I think it's cool. I do. And like I said, if one day the channel ever blows up, Misfit Island goes to the roof and there's a half dozen of these things and there's hundreds of thousands, if not millions of people watching the YouTube videos because they love the doggies and, and they love what we're doing and blah, blah, blah. And we're helping broken toys. See, I could see all of that happening one day. But my crystal ball hasn't been working too good lately, right? When it comes to my predictions with the stock market and whatnot, price of oil, interest rates, right? I was thinking $10 gas already by now, should have been, and 10% interest rate. We didn't see either one of those come to fruition. Wrong, wrong, and wrong again. And good, I'm glad, man, because what I see coming is horrific. And a lot of people aren't ready for it, right? You don't have your, you don't have your baubles. Speaking of which, Johnny doesn't have his baubles on. Ooh. Uh, 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 uh. Oh man, 
that pinky ring is always a motherfucker to get on. I'm trying. The gadget recently had me sign some BS new rules and regulations for what you can and can't do on the gadget. Oh, my skull ring is over by the sink. Um, so I have a feeling the F-bombs are maybe why they're not no good for you Johnny because someone else was saying something in a video about how uh, they're not swearing because it kills the channel now I don't care if it kills the commercials but I hate to see it not get the word out right and then when I look at a, a person like Watson who's got hundreds of thousands I think he's 400,000 if I'm not mistaken on his YouTube channel and home he's got potty mouth something fierce right <clears throat> he can he can rival me with the way he speaks and he's still got 400,000 folks on his stuff so I gotta imagine it can't be the f-bombs you know right <laughs> you know maybe it's just me <laughs> nobody wants to see my silliness maybe they want to see mama dog mama dog decided to be lap dog today huh old lady you're so pretty you're so pretty look at she's got oh you're such a nervous wreck she's always flinching if i touch her and she doesn't see it coming but she's get all this old lady jaw stuff and i mean are you kidding me can you see how no i won't tease her but man, her teeth look down, right? But shit, man, this girl is 16 years old, 15, 16 years old. I'm pretty sure she's on MySpace, homie. She's been around a long time. I'm very grateful for every minute we got together, huh, mama dog? Yes, ma'am. Yeah, you rest easy. She sits in my lap. And stares out the window right this is daddy's spot sitting here looking out the window she loves it man a lot more so than kimba kimba will get up here every once in a while but see how mama's staring right out the window and then heaven forbid a deer comes out there -da 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 -da, boy she goes bananas and, and <laughs> sometimes i'm sitting here chilling nice and quiet all of a sudden she lights off after a deer and it just startles the shit out of me. But I don't hoot at her. She's a dog, that's her job, to bark. <laughs> oh, mama, yeah. Oh, lovely. Got the burps out. Oh, yeah. We just opened a new bag of dog food. New flavor, new whatever, but all the same natural stuff locally made by the way right up here in wisconsin these guys love it and what comes out the other end everything is cool even for old dogs she is really everything's very blessed what can i say like i said she's very healthy all right i'm gonna get off the gadget just had to do my morning check-in with you guys yeah this other video Oops, it turned itself off. I'm trying to get it to reset. Uh, uh, there you go, right? I've been trying to load this thing since yesterday. It's terrible. Absolutely terrible. I don't understand. I'm trying to load this thing since yesterday is terrible. But I could search the web for it. I wasn't talking to her. I guess maybe I had fat finger. <laughs> Fucking gadgets, man. I don't trust these things. And you listen to any of these uh, alphabet cats that get on the gadget and run their mouth? And I've always known this. Everything you say, whether your gadget is on or off, is irrelevant. Everything your camera is pointed at, they can see and they can hear. You don't think so, well, good for you, right? You think about 
what's coming with digital currencies, with all the money printing and all of this inflation and everything that's been going on. You just watch and see what's coming. We're going to be living in a science fiction movie like, <laughs> like you can't believe. And we already are. I've had this conversation with Dave Dog. Here I go running my mouth again. But when I was a kid, here we go again. When I was a kid, I walked to school uphill both ways in the snow. <laughs> no, but for real. When I was a kid, my television set had tubes in it, antennas with tinfoil on it. My telephone was bolted to the wall. My TV was in black and white. There was maybe seven channels. Two, four, five, seven, 11, maybe, UHF, VHF, telling you. And then you had 44, 36, and 20. There you go, that was the whole spiel. Ain't much. And now, we got cars that drive all by themselves in Frisco. Just go ask Dave Dog. He's been next to him. That trips me out. And then let's not even talk about the crime. There was some fool in Frisco that just hosed down a lady because she was acting stupid out in front of his business, right? And when he was doing it, he was sitting there smiling. And then when the public got all fussy, he apologized and then the cops decide to arrest him. It's sad, right? But you know, the lesson there is, lay down mama, come here, come here. Yeah. The lesson in that is, stick up for yourself. Make a little noise. And you know what? Maybe the cops will do their job, right? Unless it's the Pelosi house. How come that's not in the news? Whatever happened to the hammer? Whatever happened to the dude that was at Nancy Pelosi's house? What happened, what happened, what happened in that house? I want to know, right? It's a little more important to me than some dude with a hose that needs to get his, you know, what kicked for being a piece of, you know, what, right? So anyway, <laughs> here I go running my mouth some more. While my dog's getting fidgety and uh, it's hard for me to concentrate if I can't see myself and I'm looking at her head. I'm not really thinking about what I'm saying. So time to go. Y'all have a beautiful day. Much love and respect from me and the girls. You know how we do. Love the ones that love you back. Do your best with the rest. Do not let the children hear the F-bombs. Oh, now look, she's all nice and lays down for Papa. Now I could chat some more. <laughs> anyway. Sooner or later, there is a almost three hour video that will be up on the gadget and it'll be me mowing snow. I shit you not, I just clipped it on and <laughs> it might be a little entertaining for a couple of people, but it's part of the, um, what do you call it? The uh, 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 journal. All right. On that note, you guys have a beautiful day. We'll talk soon. Peace.